Once again, the French Alps are alive with the sound of golf as the stars of the LPGA head to the Evian Championship this weekend. For the first time this year, this long-standing tournament played just over the border from Switzerland gets major championship status, becoming the fifth major of the women's season. All eyes will again be on Inby Park at the Evian as she returns to defend the title and after missing out at the British Open, attempts to win her fourth major of 2013. This tournament gave me a lot of, a lot of confidence um, going into my you know, game and you know, after win this week, uh, win this week last year, I just felt you know, a lot more comfortable on the golf course, a lot more confident. I would really love to win this week, not, not because I'm playing for four major, but because this tournament is just really special for me. So, you know, I just really want to do my best and I'm sure the, the experience I had in the British Open, like all the pressure I had and you know, the things I experienced in the British will help me, you know, going through this week. So, yeah, I think this week's going to be a much better week. It was America's Stacey Lewis who ended Park's major streak at St Andrews and who finished just behind her at the Evian last year, her second consecutive runner-up finish at this prestigious French tournament. You know, I'm trying to hang with MB. i got to win a few majors to keep up with her, but whether it has a major title or not doesn't really matter to me. Um, but it is nice coming back. The last two years obviously played really well here. I have good memories, so it's nice coming back to that. A little disappointed that the golf course is different just because I played well in the other one, but um, you know, it is what it is, and you go out there and try to do the best you can. Yes, quite a bit of work has been done to toughen up the course since it was granted major status and make it a more demanding examination. The focus has been on the closing stretch, especially the 18th, which has been converted from a reachable par 5 to a testing par 4. It's really to bring uh, uh, life to, uh, to a real new course. Um, it's, it's a very specific area. The nest here between the lake and the Alps makes it already very unique. And I think the difficulties, the bunkers, the, the par 3, which uh, will be probably one of the signature of this course. The, the 15, 16, 17, 18 puzzle, uh, which is going to make uh, uh, really the suspense very hard uh, at the end. The multi-million pound redesign took nine months to complete. Not bad considering the course is covered in snow over the winter. One of the biggest visual differences comes in the absence of any grandstands on the course. They've been replaced by Masters Augusta-style seating. And I think what we wanted to bring is really bring life to, to, to what we have dreamt about with the architects and with the, all the, the people, and I think it's there. It's still very fragile because it's so young, uh, but in nine months they, they were able to, to do miracles. Almost a month on from Colorado, all the members of both Solheim Cup teams are in town, including Spain's Beatrice Ricari, a two-time winner already this year. It gives you that extra confidence and that extra belief that you know you've done it before and you've succeeded. So why not, uh, you know, do it many more times? And you know, I feel very confident about this week. Uh, I really like the changes on this golf course. Uh, the par threes are really good, and then uh, you know, hopefully the weather stays nice and calm, and then we can have some uh, some good competition. The Evian has always been one of the richest events in the women's game. Now, with a prize fund boosted to more than 3 million euro, it's further evidence of a move up the golfing scale. We've always considered this event to be a major. It's been the Avion Masters. It's a big purse, it's a stellar field, and it's such a great setting, and they've always treated this event like a major. So it feels pretty similar here. One of the, the great perks of being a, a past champion here is you get to stay at the Hotel Royale, which is this spectacular hotel that overlooks the lake, and so it's, it's really special. This year it's going to be different, but used to be the golf course is quite short. You know, we're playing uh, pretty much short, um, so there's a many birdies opportunity on the golf course, but... Uh, um, I don't know about the, this year, you know, I heard that it's going to be play long and uh, of course it's a major so it's going to be tough setting out there so uh, it's maybe just keep making a part, that's, that's going to be the plan. Many eyes will be on 16-year-old amateur Lydia Ko, already a two-time winner on the LPGA. She's hoping to at least make the weekend at the Evian. 
Proceed to make the cut. Um, I, I went out and did some practice, and uh, I noticed the greens were quite undulated. So, you know, get it onto the right place, and uh, sometimes I think a two putt will be really good. And we'll have action from the final major of the women's season next week on Golfing World.